Hello everyone, and welcome to SpongeBob SquarePants The Cosmic Shake. I am super excited for this game. I've been waiting well over a year for this, ever since I first found out it was coming out. It was on my wish list for over a year. But it's finally out, it became available to play just a little while ago, not even a half hour. So, let's get into it. I'm ready! I'm ready, I'm ready! I forgot something, I forgot something! Now I'm really ready! Now I'm really ready! Woo! I'm so excited to go to Glove World! I better meet up with Patrick before he forgets what day it is, or who I am. Gary and... Good morning, Gare Bear. Uh -huh. I'm glad to see you and Spot doing something for the environment. It's not waste if you don't waste it. Hey, Squidward. No, 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 not you. Not today. This day will be about relaxation and inspiration. I am not to be disturbed on my precious day off. I will spend it with the love of my life. Myself. And my art, of course. Sounds fun. Can I help? For this, I need you to get something very important for me. Go away! Love you too, Squidward. Can I attack? Doesn't feel like it. Nah, not yet, I don't think. Oh. Hello! Who are you then? Can I... Can I double jump? I can double jump already. Okay. You ever get the sense you're being controlled by a higher power? Or like, some kid? Hmm. I'm not a kid, I'm a 24 year old man. Can I push you off? <sighs> no, not in a Spongebob game, probably. Alrighty. Patrick. Actually, hold on. What are the boundaries here? Okay, I'll probably drown if I touch that water, so... Oh, oh. Okay, the jellyfish are mean. Just like last time. Go away. I'm rehearsing my lines. <clears throat> the soup of the day is chicken noodle. As I wave around like a noodle. I see. Who are you then? Why are you running from me? Me. Oh. Okay. Hey, ah! let's make oh, eye contact. Oh, eye contact? A boat! Can I drive it? Hey, Mrs. Puff, look at me. I'm in the driver's seat. Nah, I can't do anything with it, okay. Alright, enough fooling around. Oh, and before I begin, I did have a bunch of armor footage for another video that I was going to do, that was going to come out, but my editing software broke, and I've been unable to replace it, so these videos are going to be relatively unedited, so I'm thinking I'll just do a level, stop recording, then do more. Just so we're aware of what's going on here. Come back after my alarm goes off! I'm on a tight beauty sleep schedule! I wouldn't bother going that way if I were you, SpongeBob. Big traffic jam blocking the road up ahead. Hi, Karen. Why are you overseeing this? What? Then how is everyone enjoying food at the Krusty Krab? They aren't. See for yourself. I'm stuck here with the owners of rivaling restaurants, the Chum Bucket and Krusty Krab. Seems like a perfect opportunity to start a documentary about Bikini Bottom's best restaurant. Good idea! A movie about how delicious the chum bucket is would rake in millions! 
Hey, you know I meant the Krusty Krab. Nobody goes to the Chum Bucket, unless it's to ask for directions away from it. Anyway, officials are still investigating where the nails that caused this chaotic collision came from. Maybe Mr. Krabs can help find the culprit. He did have a truck full of nails delivered the other day. He must know a lot about nails. I thank you. Anything special? No? Okay. All right, back it up. Nothing to see here except the giant traffic jam. Howdy, SpongeBob! You're up earlier than an insomniac rooster! In the mood for a little morning karate? Love to, but we'll have to put some padding on that one, Sandy. Patrick and I are about to have the best day ever at Glove World. Do you want to come? Thanks. But you ain't putting no glove on this squirrel. I'd rather seek the thrill of toning exercises and rubber duckies. But if you got a little time to spare, I could use your help hauling out some old junk from my yard. Anything for you, Sandy. I'm ready to haul, y'all. There we go. Did I get smaller or did these tiki's get bigger? Oh, I don't even get nothing from them. Pearl, and how are you on this beautiful day? Oh, SpongeBob, didn't you hear? It's a tragedy. There's a huge sale at the mall today, but because of this stupid traffic jam, none of the buses can get me there. That is a tragedy. Well, the bus to Glove World is still running. You could join me and Patrick there instead. Um, thanks, but I have a social status to uphold. You have fun without me, SpongeBob. How could this happen to me? Why is my life, like, set to tragedy? Sorry, my rectangular friend. Nobody's getting through right now. We're still sorting out this massive traffic jam. Oh, I see. Well, thanks anyway, officer. Good luck cracking the case. Huh, I wonder who's at fault here. Probably that guy. Quiet down, I'm trying to sleep with my eyes open. Old Man Jenkins, are you spying on that nurse? Mermaid Man sure likes to leave his invisible boatmobile exposed. I'm sorry. Found a secret. beloved bikini bottom the most perfectly perfect place in the entire universe home to my friends and memories good morning best friend are you ready for a lovely adventure not nah. what am i i stayed up all night pretending i had hands three three hours later <laughs> Look, Patrick, 
cool kids. <laughs> Hi. Meh. <sighs> I wish I could do cool things. This wagon just ominously appeared out of nowhere? Who cares? Hmm. Uh, nah. Still not cool enough. Huh? Can I have this? What, this old piece of... magic and mystery? Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Madame Cassandra, purveyor of long-lost treasures of the Seven Seas. For those on a budget. Magic bubbled soap. Breathe life into your dreams. They say with this unique bubble maker thingy you can become whoever you want to be receive whatever you want to have just bubble your wish into the heavens not that it ever worked for me Ooh. three hours later i wish no i wish no i wish oh, the... oh, okay my first wish is on behalf of my very best friend who loves balloons. I wish for Patrick to have the biggest, balloonyest adventure of his life. <laughs> balloons! Is it too much to ask for just one day of peace and quiet? How am I supposed to paint my newest masterpiece with you two clowns constantly giggling in my ear? I wish that Squidward will finally be appreciated for his art. What are you two up to? Wait for it. I wish for the whole world to see how amazing Sandy is. Thanks, SpongeBob! Nifty bubble! <laughs> Three hours later. <laughs> <laughs> SpongeBob, what does it mean when it says, Only those of innocent heart may harness the power of the mermaid tears? I guess it means I was destined to find this bubble soap. Hey, wait. It also says, Property of King Neptune, not for use by mortals. Use sparingly and with caution. Uh oh. <laughs> Patrick, what have we done? Who would have thought that a magic potion from a mysterious fortune teller in a sketchy wagon could backfire? Yes, it was utterly unforeseeable. Wait a second! Patrick, you're a balloon! I wish. If I were a balloon, I'd be able to do cool stuff like this! And this! And this! See, SpongeBob? Oh, I am a balloon! That's probably why I've been feeling so bloated lately. We need to find our friends and make sure they're all right! Okay. I think Squidward is such an even-tempered fella, or he might get upset about this. Yeah. He won't mind that at all. My rock! My beautiful giant rock! All that's left are my... Oh no! My giant sticky notes are gone too! Now how am I gonna remind myself to buy more giant sticky notes? Don't worry, Patrick. I'm sure those sticky notes are around here somewhere. Or there. Or over there. Ah. 
Ouch. Looks pretty broken. Oh no, Sandy's dome. She can't survive without that. Wait a minute. Maybe all this craziness is from one of Sandy's experiments gone wrong. I bet it's all her fault. I don't think so, Patrick. Sandy's experiments always leave the smell of acorns in the air. All I smell around here is... <gasps> sponge breath and bubble soap. Oh, yeah. That's the good stuff. Glad you like the smell of my breath, Patrick. Is the invisible boatmobile still there? It's not! That is fascinating. Weird. Sandy's house feels wetter than usual. I think we might need to find the top half still. I can finally put my black belt to good use. And all this time, I've been using it as a scarf. Why? Why would you use it for that? Darn it. All right. Moving on. Oh? How to glide. Oh, God. I'm gonna assume it's hold space. Yep, definitely hold space. Get me sweet! Crab, what will the brave people of Bikini Bottom eat now? And without Mr. Krabs, who will help them unburden their wallets? I need to fix this. Okay, this is where take your wobbly hand off of me. I'm too smart to end like this. Evidently, this is where Battle for Bikini Bottom meets Globs of Doom. I love it. That was like one of my favorite games. At least on the Wii. Oh, I can dodge. Let's give that a try. Well, I've never seen a fish like this. Ouch! Okay, didn't work. You multicellular idiots! Thanks to you, all of Bikini Bottom is sunk into chaos. My restaurant is tipped over, and our poor little spot is missing. You could have at least involved me. That's like, you know, my thing. Correct. Oh, no! Sorry, Plankton. We'll make things right again. You have to fix this before someone besides me can take advantage of this chaos. Correct. Why are you repeating yourself? Is your hard drive skipping again? In. Correct. Yoo hoo! Over here, my little blunders. Ah, no more chafing. My adorable cuties! You survived this calamity. No, oh, Madam Cassandra! We were just having fun, but we accidentally used too much of your magic bubble soap and destroyed Bikini Bottom! And now all of our friends are gone, and there's jelly everywhere, and... 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 Well, I miss my Gare Bear! <laughs> oh, this is just too perfect. That's not just any jelly, SpongeBob. It's cosmic jelly, the glue of reality. 
Your bubble stravaganza must have blown holes through the universe, squeezing the jelly out and sucking your friends into new and strange worlds. That was going to be my first guess. You have to bring me as much of it as you can gather so I can study it and, um, help reverse the mess you've created. After all, I'm at least partially responsible giving you such a powerful potion by accident. Makes sense to me. Uh, no questions here. Excellent. Now jump into the portals that opened up all over town. I can use some of the jelly to tailor cosmic costumes for you, each linked to one portal. The more jelly you bring, the more portals we can pass. Are you ready? I'm ready! Come on, let's save Bikini Bottom from the unintended yet devastating consequences of our own actions. <laughs> Find the portal that suits your costume. Once you have located your friends, you can use the magic bubble wand to return them home. Charming. Use the soap to a shop. God. Use the shop to equip and purchase SpongeBob's costumes. Unlock costumes by playing the story, collecting the blooms, and completing side quests. Ooh, side quests. This is a proper game. Use cosmic jelly to purchase unlocked costumes. Access the shop in the pause menu. Oh, boys! You must feel awful about this, huh? I mean, Ooh, it is my fault. I look like some kind of pastoral cattle rancher. I wonder if there's a name for something like that. A little dabble, do ya? Was I not supposed to do that? School's out, SpongeBob. I have a bit of a heated situation here. Sorry about that, Mrs. Puff. I may or may not have done that. the point of a water tower I guess that's a tower that shows that you're underwater that's stupid I can dig it <laughs> oh I found one of Patrick's sticky notes okay you're welcome Patrick can I assess the damage here there's the register what restaurant needs tables oh no my grill Oh, darn it. One of our friends might be on the other side of this portal. Come on, Patrick. We have to rescue them. It's our friendship duty. I have a strong feeling we're not Bikini Bottom anymore. Looks more like the Wild West. Yeet! Ho! Yeet! Ho! Yeet! Ho! Drown! Oh, sorry, partner. I'm looking for my pal, Mr. Krabs. About yay high, red, likes money? Crab problem, eh? <laughs> I reckon you're gonna want to talk to the sheriff in Manta Fe. You're gonna want to talk to the sheriff in Manta Fe. Phew, 
Ooh, what a fun ride! Yeah, let's get in line and ride it again! Order up! Uh-oh. Well, he's wanted already. Why am I, I not surprised? Don't give us wants with this stuff! The only thing I make out of jelly is jelly sandwiches! Patrick, Cassandra knows what she's doing. If she says bringing her jelly will help get our friends back, then bring her jelly we shall. Ooh, more jelly! Is there anything down there? It does not look like there is. I'll probably come back. Ooh, more jelly! SpongeBob, what do you see? Water? Soda? Is soda water? What do you see? Barnacles, it's so small! We'll never fit in there! Why do we have to be so big? No, oh, it's not small, Patrick. It's not? It's just very, very far away. We're safe, Patrick! It's Mrs. Puff! If anyone knows where Mr. Krabs is, it's her! She probably doesn't know us here, even though she knows us back home. Here we have to get to know her first. Just like we got to know her the first time she got to know us back home, you know? No. A little dabble, do ya? Pursue that paraphernalia! Look at me go! What's this luggage doing in the middle of the desert? I think it dropped from Mrs. Puff's carriage. Oh, so far so good. Oh. Okay, so right click. Simple as that, eh? Coming at ya! A little dabble do ya! Okay, so the bubble probably keeps them trapped for a little bit of time, but not permanent. I feel like I've had several near-death experiences on this ranch before. Yeah, it's the Wild West for you. Whoa, is that Mrs. Puff? What's she doing on a ranch? Mmm, I love ranch. I'm feeling better already. Ooh, more jelly. Oh. I made a mistake. Oh, wait. Not vital, though. Anything over here? No? Okay. Hey!
I probably shouldn't spend too much time hunting for secrets. I can't edit these videos at the moment, so I need to make them as short as possible because I don't want to be uploading 40 minute videos. Howdy, strangers! You came here by foot? That's awfully dangerous. You could dry out in a heartbeat. I get puffy just thinking about it. I get puffy after eating snail food. Hi, my name's SpongeBob, and this balloon is Patrick. We're looking for our friend, Mr. Krabs, but he might not be called Mr. Krabs. He could be traveling under a different name. Oh, like Jeremy. Or Petunia. Or Captain Claus. Or Ronaldo. A crab without a name, huh? Try Manta Fay. It's where everyone without something ends up. Could you give us a ride there? This is a riding school, not a taxi service. However, if you take my test, you could get there yourself with your own riding license. My very own license? Whenever you're ready, meet me by the seahorse. We'll see if you can stay on it all the way to Manta Fay. <laughs> All right. I saw Shiny over there. Sounds like an adventure within our adventure. Double adventure. Just look at that breathtaking pastoral landscape. The beauty of nature. Ah, uh, well, that didn't hey, work out. You think they got vending machines here? The Krusty Krab pizza is the pizza for you and me. Nope, did not work. So is Patrick gonna do that every time there's a secret nearby, or? The Krusty Krab Pizza is the pizza for you and me. Well, that's not what I wanted. Look at me go! There's a whole lot here. I'm definitely going to have to come back anyway, so let's just get on with it. Okay, so alt seems to be a roll. Oh, no, wait. Was that the dodge you tried to teach me about? I thought it said control. I must have misread it. Uh, Mrs. Puff, I mean, teacher lady, uh, I need to confess that uh, I've been through this sort of thing before, and uh, I'm not always the best test taker, so, uh, so any chance we can skip this part? Oh, nonsense, SpongeBob. <laughs> a little rodeo never hurt anyone who survived it. Ready, set, and go! No! Okay, boost, shift, okay. SpongeBob, jump! A little dabble, do ya? Well done, SpongeBob. You scored 35.7 points. Go around! Keep on smashing! Sticky sweet! SpongeBob, look out! Okay. I don't think there was a way to stop. Oh, that is so unforgiving. Oh, but it refreshes the... Yeah, I definitely wasted time here. You can retry my riding test if you like. Just jump on the seahorse when you're ready. You scored 35.7 points. Keep on smashing. Spider, look out! That's uh, I, I, 
he lost his pants. Don't make me call my insurance agent. Jump. All right, just keep Ooh, jumping. Ooh, more jelly. Red usually means stop. You did not just abandon me all the way out here. Oh dear, you have six points. What does that mean? <laughs> out of seven. <laughs> Only one point away from passing. Yay! Oh, can we repeat the test? It was so much fun. Oh no, that's not necessary. I, I didn't know you had fun. Fun is worth an extra point. Here's your license. Thanks, partner. Oh, license! Yeehaw! SpongeBob! Hey! Hold your horses! Oh, I don't think she can! This license only allows me to ride seahorses and seahorse like animals. With the exception of. Uh, this doesn't say anything about boatmobiles. Well, once boatmobiles have been invented, I'll just have to take the test again. I wonder if there was anything. Yeehaw! Oh, we made we it to Manta Fey, my floating friend. My butt is killing me from all that riding you had to do. It's Sandy! I mean, it's the sheriff! Now look what the snail dragged in! You may be yellow as mustard, but you got the bite! Oh, don't bite! Too unsanitary! I'm looking for my friend, Mr. Krabs. Have you seen him? He's got big, beautiful eye stalks and tiny little legs. I'm off duty for the dole, sweetie, but hey, if you can take me, I might look into your case. Yo, Ann? Better get yourself a straw partner and make sure it sips straight. We're gonna have ourselves a nice little cactus soda showdown. There ain't a sea critter alive that can drink more soda than me. You're going down faster than a baby at nap time. Jelly bandits! Taking on them jelly bandits like that? Let's see what you're really made of. Grab your straw! Cheers! Bottoms up! Salute! Cheers! Red-handed bandits, bandits took over our cactus farms. We've been running low on supplies. Any chance you can go up to Cactin Hills and fetch some more cactus juice for us? The sooner we can finish our duel, the sooner I can solve your crab case. Don't you worry, Sheriff. Deputy SpongeBob. And Balloon Deputy Patrick. Are on the case. Beautiful. A little dabble, do ya? Ow! Hey, that was my hiding barrel. I don't like cactuses. They're not even pretty. They're just green, juicy, and thorny. L like a cucumber that hurts your mouth when you eat it. Don't worry, Patrick. We'll be out of here as soon as we find more cactus juice.
Uh-oh. Looks like it wants to duel. Maybe that kind of familiar looking gentleman can point us in the right direction. Howdy, sir. I'm SpongeBob SquarePants. Have we met before? Hey, cowboy. Uh, sorry, uh, you don't ring any bells. But I couldn't help but overhear you talking about entering the cactus beverage business. That demands a strong spine. I suggest hiring a consultant to guide you for a wee share of, um, 70%. I'll tell you where to find the cacti with the most refreshing sap. Folks pay insane amounts of money for them since the shortage. 70%? That sounds a bit fishy. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I say 70? I meant, um, 80, of course. Now we're talking. Just keep going till you reach them cactine hills. And don't ye scam your hard-working consultant. I'm only taking 90% of the business. Come on, Patrick. Let's find those thorny cucumbers. A secret hunt. Okay. The Krusty Krab pizza is the pizza for you and me. A secret hunt when... I'm not recording. Ooh, look! An old warning sign. It says... Cacteen Hills. Spines, deadly heat, bandits, and quicksand. Enjoy! This seems pretty dangerous, SpongeBob. Maybe there's a seahorse around here in need of a licensed rider. Sorry! Oh, baby, that cactus is way up there, huh? I've never seen a fish like this. I wasn't even sure if I was going the right way. Woo! <laughs> Funny meeting you here. Just, uh, checking on the barrels. You know, keeping them safe from bandits. There's Juicy Prophet, I mean, uh, Cacti, all around these parts. Now get! This is it, Patrick! The juicy cactus gold awaits us! Yeet! Oh. Ah, no more chafing. Order up! If I could even... Okay, you won't climb up onto these like you will everything else. Would you start climbing? You don't climb anymore. 
Okay, you're going there. Oh, that looks fun. I bet I could get down faster than you. Oh, I unlocked a shortcut. Okay, I see what I'm doing here. Ooh, more jelly! The Krusty Krab Pizza is the pizza for you and me! Krusty Krab Pizza is the pizza for you and me. No, thank you. I wonder if something is over there. The Krusty Krab Pizza is the pizza for you and me. Hey, look, it's the appetizer. I remember you. I was supposed to hit him. It really didn't feel like it. That should cover my buns. Come on! We gotta bring all this sap back to that guy who looks kind of familiar. A little dabble, do ya? Was I supposed to be able to make that? I ran out of glide real easy. You got a knack for reaching them cacti. Just drop the juice in this here barrel for, uh, <laughs> safekeeping. <laughs> One barrel down. Follow that trail, my little saps. I think I'm going to have to cut the first video here. I will upload the next one right away.